Hey everyone, what's up? This is Blaze. Welcome to a new Pirate 101 video. Today we're going to be looking at Dead Mike's quest line, which I guess I'll put him up here a little bit, uh, which is added in the new uh, update to Pirate 101. They've added a couple of the companions have new quest lines, and that involves Captain Hand. So I've got Dead Mike up to level 70, so he has a new promotion. We're going to head into the tavern here and uh, go ahead and start this because I'm pretty excited to see what the Captain Hand storyline is actually all about. Where's the tavern seller actually at? It's up here. Nope, it is not up there, Quest Arrow. So, yeah, I think it's uh, around this way. And then, uh... Oh, yeah, it's down here. Let's see what this thing's all about. Oh, I've never actually been down here in the cellar. Looks interesting. I'm not sure what to make of this, Captain, but I thought you'd need to know. I've gotten a letter from a man who says he's your next of kin. I knew this bloke long ago. Bob Carrington's his name. Now he says he's your uncle on your mother's side. She never mentioned him to me. Maybe it's all a trick, but maybe, maybe it isn't. If he's your uncle, Bob can tell you more about your mother than I ever could. I also reckon that if Bob is lying, we can deal with him easily enough. I'll be on my guard. Bob's in Flotsam. Do you want to meet him? I mean, I guess we have to for the quest, don't we? We're gonna get the Undead Vindicator. What is he right now? Undead Avenger. Yeah. Okay, on to Flotsam. Alright, here we are. I mean, there's so many different places they could hide in Flotsam. Like, different hideouts, different areas come back here multiple times with like a quest to go in some weird place but I'm wondering how long this quest line for the captain hand actually is because the most recent uh, companion promotion that I did was bat Masterson and that was the longest promotion I've ever done I don't know I was just in Aquila forever it felt like I oh, was in here and I don't know that companion promotion Wow now so much to it Nutella about the wheel, one way or another. I don't want trouble. Anything you say. Captain Hook? Anything I say was an excellent philosophy. Now, pirate, get him now. All right, look, looks like we got Captain Hook here. <laughs> He's getting attacked. Uh, let's just go ahead and put blood flames down. There's no really good place to put them, except like here. <laughs> I just put them there. All right, Bonnie Ann. Eh, let's wait on that. Let's just start shooting people. I'm on it. And then we've got a uh, dead Mike too. Move him up. I haven't used dead Mike in a while. I should switch to my uh, nefarious staff. No, it's okay. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Yeah, I don't know why the bat one was so long. <laughs> Maybe it makes bat masters really good. I don't know. I'm hoping this one isn't as long as that one. But the companion promotions can uh, you know, involve a lot just random things to do oh I killed the thing so it didn't hit him it would have killed him wow that's unfortunate I should have just shot the well I no, if I shot the barrel with Bonnie and it would have blown up my own flames that would have been even worse okay don't really need a refresh or that uh, let's go ahead and I'm gonna start. Oh, I should just kill this guy, I guess, or try to. In this, you attack this guy. All right, let's see what you got, Dead Mike. He just got, like, stunned. <laughs> what the heck? He didn't even use his attack. What was that? 
Dead Mike, come on. Wow, no health. He's not even attacking anymore. Like, he has Vengeance Strike, but he's not using it. Alright, let's finish these guys off. 1400. Yeah, that should clear him out. Let's start going for this guy. Wow, it used up his thing, but I don't even think he actually used it. I don't know what that was. Weird. Well, I guess he's here just to tank damage. Okay. Get this. Everyone just attack him. Dang it, old screwed. They've also updated a few things. This is the patch since test realm, or since it went to live realm. They fixed some things like the cane fight and stuff. Well, Mike, I see you got my message. Well timed. Good to see you again, Mike. It's been an age. And did you bring... Yes, Captain. I've heard a lot about you. But look at you. I see my sister Jenny in your face. Pirate Jenny. It's enough to break my heart. Don't call me Mike. About Jenny, who you miss so much. She wasn't named Carrington when I met her. Suspicious, isn't it? You mean before she married? Father disowned her when she told him she was going to be a pirate. Like me, she took her mother's maiden name. Ah, that would explain it. But she never mentioned any of that to me. Never said she had a brother either. Care to explain? We had a falling out. I tried to convince her to go back home. It didn't end well. Go back home? To where exactly? Darkmoor. Look here, if you're going Darkmoor. to stand around and test me all day, we'll lose our chance to get the map piece. Map? What map? Marco Poyo's map. I know the whole story. I'm not sure where Jenny hid her piece, but I know how to find it. It should go to my nephew. In the last message she ever sent me, Jenny told me the wheel held the key to her greatest treasure. I never knew what she meant until recently. It's the code wheel, a big thing made of brass, like an astrolabe. Spin the upper plate, and holes in it reveal words on the disc underneath. Jenny made the wheel to reveal the location of her map piece, if you know how to align plate and disc, that is. I've just learned how. Your mother split the wheel and hid both parts. I know where the upper plate's buried, and how to line it up once we find the disc. What do you say? Game for a treasure hunt? Dead Mike, how well do you know this man? Can we trust him? He knows quite a lot about Jenny, this much is true. Can we trust him? Maybe. As much as we could trust any pirate, I suppose. That's reassuring. So, Uncle Bob, just where is this place? <laughs> Uncle Bob. It's buried in Traitor's Cave. Now that name inspires confidence. Oh, you have no idea. A fine place, right, Ratbeard? Enough of that. Captain, what are we standing around for? If there's even a chance this Bob can lead us to a bit of the map, we're fools not to try. Agreed. Let's go. And Bob, know this. Kin to my captain or no, if you betray us, you'll end up like me. That's a promise. I understand. Now, we're not the only ones hunting for the wheel, remember? Let's go. Okay, that's actually an interesting bit of storyline that's behind this. Let me put on the nefarious staff. And where's Trader's Cove at? It's in uh, School Island Skyway. So I'll head over there and we'll continue our treasure hunt. Back to Trader's Cave. Been here before. Way back. <laughs> the plate's buried in that side chamber. Hurry! I don't know what else could be in here. Oh, is that it? There's nothing here, Captain. And there's a fresh hole in the sand. Looks like somebody beat us to it. Stand by for ambush! What is this? Some kind of trick? How'd you know to come here anyway? 
Did you pick Traitor's Cave for a reason? No, Trick. I'm as surprised as you are. As to how I knew it was here, on his deathbed, one of my sister's former shipmates. Which one? What? More tests? It was Spiny Norman. The Hedgehog? I hadn't heard he died. It's only been a few days. Tragic, really. He told me all about the wheel before he died. I swear to you. But who took the plate? There are lots of tracks. Fresh, too. Rats, crabs, and... That's odd. Looks like they went poking around in the sand with a broom handle. Whoever it was, they didn't do it very long ago. Whoever they were, somebody must have seen them come and go. Let's ask a few questions outside. I thought that was the plate at first. I'm like, oh, there it is, right there. They were lying. It actually was just, you know, sitting there. But, nah, it's not going to be that easy. Let's talk to Crimson Jake. Nah, I didn't see nobody. So clear off. They pay you? Or ye can do better than that, Jake, me boy. Talk, or I'll have your other leg, too. No, don't leave me with just one hand. I seen that. Not an hour ago, a gang of rats and crabs walked in the cave led by a horror of a pirate. Two peg legs he had, and a hook hand made into a blade besides. Kept balance with a cane he did. Walking like a spider, he were the leader. Bless my soul, that's Captain Hand. Aye, a meaner and more stubborn pirate never sailed. Now, tell us more. His gang, they had a big satchel, all sandy with something heavy in it. They sailed away. That's all I see. That's all I know. I thought Captain Hand retired after he lost his other leg. The thugs that came after me must be his crew. And used to hole up in Scrimshaw. Let's go find him. Off to Scrimshaw. We seem to go between, like, Flotsam and Scrimshaw a lot. It's a common theme. Good thing Ratbeard knows where his hideout is. Because I wouldn't have known where to go. But there's a ton of hideouts around here anyway. <laughs> oh, it's in here. Look, lads, the captain said someone had come sniffing. Get him! And he was right. Oh, we got blood flames again. Hmm. I think, uh, I don't know. Let's just wait off on that. Go with this. Come on, just shove him in the corner. Yeah, head over there. So you can do, Dead Mike. I'll give you a buff, hopefully help you. It's a start. I've also gotten all my companions up to level 70, so we're set. And I tried to farm Kane a little bit, but I don't know, I got some things. Nothing crazy. Plus, I feel like to complete my gear on my Witch Doctor, I'd rather get stuff from Moo Manchu. But maybe I'll do a video on the Kane gear that I have so far. A lot of it's for other classes. I think I have the entire Privateer set. Alright, what do we get? How much is Blood Flames going to do? 2,000. This is also doing 1,200, which will pretty get, like, you're pretty close to killing these guys. I think it'll kill that guy, for sure. Use this on him. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, I almost forgot about you, Dead Mike. There you go. Yeah. 
No burst fire today. Ow. <laughs> that was a lot of damage. Do I have a uh, embrace? Yeah. That'll heal me up. Especially if I'm, you know, super hit. <laughs> oh my gosh. Just completely full health, like over full health. Stop! I beg you. Is it the wheel you want? It's in that foot locker there. There's no way you can talk after I just Jobu embraced everyone and sucked their soul out. Hey, here's the wheel. Or the plate half of it anyway. Where's the rest of it? And where's hand? Come on, you're not finished talking yet. Captain Hand, he's gone. As soon as he dropped off that bit of brass, he was off again. Where to? Well, that's a bit of a tale. You see, there's this old friend of the captain's. Well, maybe not a friend, but the two ain't killed each other yet. Funny how they met, though. After the cutthroats took the captain's leg, his right leg, that is, Hand were crawling out of the cutthroat cove and... Quit your stalling and get to the point. Where's he gone? Where's who gone? And who in blazes are you lot? Yar! I thought you'd never get back. Trounce these blighters. Trounce them. Why does he still have a question thing? I don't know. Uh, let's go ahead and buff. Get some of that. Use, yeah, might as well use that. And then uh, attack this guy. Pretty good. Guys got <laughs> Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no. That is so much damage. He did five hundred, like one eighty times three or four, and then another five hundred. Come on, dude. Wow. <laughs> well, we need to use some kind of uh, heal slash Jobu. Oh, we do got Jobu. Let's do it on these guys. Oh, I want to kill this guy, though. But I need to do that. Uh, let's do this. Start to start attacking this guy because he does way too much damage. And we'll summon that. Good. Epic hit. Come on, give me the burst fire, bunny. I mean, a little, need a little more than that. A little more damage than that one. Are they going for me again? No. Maybe. Yeah, wow. They really want me dead. Seems like the cat guy's only a real problem. Yeah, you're dead. I mean, he can attack Dead Mike all he wants. I really don't care. I'm forced to use Dead Mike. <laughs> if he kills Dead Mike. I almost killed him. Wow, okay, you know what, Dead Mike? That was really good. I gotta give it to you on that one. I did not expect that. Who's still alive? There's three of them. 
Can hit all of them with this. This guy still has a lot of health. Let's go ahead and do that. Hopefully kill him. Okay. Old Fizzle back at it. Some good damage. A few more of those and he's dead, right? Come on, one more. Yes! Bonnie! Okay, talk to this guy again? Yeah. Man, he's gone. As soon as he dropped off that bit of brass, he was off again. What? Well, that's a fun quit your squares. Yar! I thought you'd never get back. What? These blighters. No way. Are you serious? That makes no sense. I really have to defeat this guy again. Plus, he respawned. Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna do this. I'm not gonna show it because uh, I literally just did it. So, I'll be right back. Okay, that should do it. Second battle honestly went easier than the first one did. Because <laughs> I killed the Ricky Ticky guy right away. That was uh, fun, defeating him twice. The captain, he's off to find somebody. What's his name? Uh, uh, Red Rum. No, no, no. Red Roof. Over in Jonah Town. Something about a wheel. He must know where the disc is. Let's go. There may still be time. Here we are in Jonah Town. Continuing our way through this quest line, which is called uh, Bob's your uncle, because I mean he pretty much is our uncle, unless he's lying. Which I mean, yeah, he still could be. It's possible. Talk, Red Ruth, and ye have me warned. I'll wait. Who's this? Yar, if it ain't Pirate Jenny's child. The maps are me hearties. Get him. Another battle, huh? Oh, but this one's Captain Hand. Is it Captain Hand? Yep. Captain Hand, level 67, Buccaneer. Okay, okay. Uh, we're gonna buff and then use the flames then. I don't need that. Or not flames, yeah, we're gonna buff. Buff into flames. Let's move here and... I don't know, move there, I guess. Well, let's move him there and her there. Seems like a better plan. Spooky into flames, more like it. Do a lot more. Okay. I mean, they're in perfect position to get hit by flames now, so I'll take it. Put them right here. I'm not going to move him up yet. I'll just keep him. Look for more doubloons. <laughs> Alright, Captain Hand, what do you got? <laughs> Another time, pirate. <laughs> Gets hit once. Wait, is that it? We're gonna have to defeat his enemies though, or his goons. Well, that was easy. I expected more out of the great Captain Hand. Charming gaze. You know, I don't really need charming gaze on my pets, but all of them seem to have it, so I guess I'll take it. Summon him. Can't see anyone. We'll wait for the charming gaze to get over. Mm -hmm. 
Or you mean Breeze, you could charm him again. No, I don't think that's actually possible. You can't charm the only enemy left in the battle. Come on, dead Mike, fight back. <laughs> or not. 1200 Kill 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 Yes I'm saved Thank you All it took was one blood flame I can't even talk to this guy. There we go. You came for the disc. Now I'm sworn to never tell. Just before her last voyage, Jenny made me promise. How can I break my word to her? Listen, I'm Jenny's brother, and this is Jenny's own son. Come of age at last. It's true. Will you believe your own eyes? That disc in the treasure it guards belonged to this pirate by right. You've done what Jenny asked. Now do what she'd have wanted. This pirate is Jenny's child? You're right, I see it. Very well. Jenny told me the disc's buried on Parrot Island, at the foot of Parrot Rock. Where's that again? That place. It's not far at all. And Hand, he doesn't know about it yet. We'll get there first this time. Good luck in your search, pirate. Once you have it, meet me at the Black Spot in Flotsam, and we'll see where the map is. Okay, Parrot Island, where's that at? Port Regal. Guess we're heading off to Port Regal Skyway this time. Paired Island's right here. This place is even more dismal than I remember. Still, there aren't many places it could be hidden. Uh, hey, water moles, you just want to, you know, let me walk past you and try to find this plate thing that I'm looking for? Is it a problem? No? Alright, thank you. <laughs> thank you again. And... This is the place. Let's dig. <laughs> to be honest, I didn't think that would work. Wait, where is it? The disc's not here. Red Roof must have lied to us. Maybe not. Look here, this sand's real loose. Looks like somebody dug it up before we did, and not long ago. Then somebody has much to answer for! Let's get him! Easy there, big guy. So, what should we really do? Whoever dug this up, what would they do with it? Huh. If they didn't know what it was, if, mind you, they'd try to sell it to a fence. But which one? Well, Port Regal's right over there. Want to find a fence? Ask a thief. I say we pay Mr. Litton a visit. Not a bad idea. I'm sure it might work. You know what the only sad part is? I have to now get out of here after my great mission of stealthing my way over here. Uh, I'm scared. If I get pulled now after all that I've done, all right, we gotta try it. We gotta at least try it. All right, line it up, line it up, go. Yes! Okay. That was close. That reminds me of when you have to go into Devilfish Hollow to get the clandestine spells. Which, by the way, are there new clandestine, uh, clandestine, however you say it, uh, spells for level 70? I don't even know. That'll have to be something I look into.